City made the short trip to Walsh's Meadow to face Stour Port Swifts in a Midland Football League game. City, still in the hunt for third place, started with exactly the same side that beat Hormon on Tuesday evening. Stourport lined up with former City player and manager Lee Hughes. City started brightest in the ill exchanges with Dimitri Brown crossing with no one to get on the end of the cross. But it was Stourport who nearly opened the scoring with Ethan Hansen having his header cleared by George Baker. Minutes later, City lost the ball at the back. But former City player Taylor Townsend was caught in two minds and couldn't get a shot away. Will Gibbons then forced Ryan Pratt into a good save from eight yards out. George Baker then combined with Dimitri Bain, who then cut inside two defenders before shooting from the edge of the box from an acute angle. The opening goal of the game came in the next passage of play, with City picking the ball midway in their half. Josh Huck picked up Reese Taylor Randall on the halfway line, who played a superb ball over the top through to George Baker, who made a perfectly timed run from just inside the Starport half before a superb finish just inside the box. With strong support in the crowd of 339, City went close again minutes later. Again, Reese Taylor Randall involved, played another superb ball through, this time to Dimitri Bone, who forced Ryan Pratt into a fabulous save. <laughs> Taylor Randall was involved again in City's next move, this time picking the ball up at just inside the Starport half before driving forward and firing a shot from 20 yards out, which went just over the bar. Swiss came up much stronger in the second half. Taylor Townsend doing well on the right-hand side before getting a cross in to Lee Chilton, but Aaron Roberts was on hand to put a block in. Chilton was again involved in Starport's next move after City failed to clear from a free kick. Martin Slevin and Ben Jevons helping the ball on to Chilton, but his shot on the turn went wide of Adam Harrison's post. The equaliser came in the 55th minute after City gave a free kick away on the left hand side. Drew Canavan sent the ball deep into the City box, which was headed home by Ethan Hansen. The game flowed from end to end, City having a penalty appeal waved away, and Swifts coming close again with Chilton involved and Aaron Roberts on hand to clear from the line. With eight minutes to go, Lee Hughes was introduced with Starport going for the winner and a great opportunity arose with the referee playing great advantage after Matty Jackson was brought down by Jamie Douglas but Lee Chilton's cross into the box was cut out by Fortune Mafosa with Lee Hughes waiting on the back post. It was the final chance of the game and the score ended 1-0. No!